Hey guys, this is Chaos with Tape, and today you join me with a small spacecraft um, moving around the space above the moon. Fairly standard, fairly standard spacecraft, fairly standard moon, uh, pretty standard orbit. Oh, oh wait, that's not right. There's a moon in the KSC, and actually a spaceship in Kerbin. What has happened here is um, hybrid. It. Here it is. You can edit your orbit. Um, I'm sure a lot of you have seen people just um, change their orbits. So say I want to select um, uh, my my current vessel, and I'm like I want to put it in a nice orbit. I'll put it in say, well to avoid the moon, maybe a five. Ah, you can just do 500 k because it's nice, um, and then put it around Kerbin, and then, um, hmm, okay, that's not right because there's some. Ah, right, the world blew up. Right. Anyway, what happened here is you can do that with vessels or um. You can oh Jesus Christ no stop you or you can um do it with anything you feel like such as the moon um as you can see and I put it in seventy kilometer orbit so yeah so now it's in Kerbin right um I'm I'm gonna put that back so I can demonstrate a few more things I'm just gonna quickly Google the orbit of the moon um don't know the orbit of the actual no, the actual moon's about 406,500 and something meters. Just typed in orbit there. Um, <laughs> I'm not smart and I'm tired. Leave me alone. Okay. Moon, Kerbal Space Program. I like that KSP is big enough that you don't have to type KSP after KSP based searches now. Alright. So, I'll select the moon orbit to edit. What is. Oh, the face on screen. Seriously, what? Is that, like. That's not moisture on my screen. I think my screen's packing up. All right, okay, we'll forget that. Um, <laughs> so it's 12 million meters, so I'll select orbit to edit, the moon. Um, 12 million, so one, two, three, one, two, three. Set. Yay, now the moon is back. All right, um, so I'm gonna revert my flight to launch. Uh, so I just want to mess around with this a bit. I'm not going to do a review of it. Um, this is just the most interesting thing. Oh, good, my screen's back to normal. I was really scared I'd have to buy a new screen, which I'm going to because I want a 1440p monitor. This is like... Uh, anyway. So I'm going to go to Jewel real quick. Um, oh, no, there's a lot of problems. There's more problems than just putting the moon in the surface. Say I decide I want to go to EVE. Um, select, yeah, active vessel. Um, select body. Uh, say EVE, yeah. I'm like, ooh, I'll put it in a 200k orbit. Uh, yeah, ooh, yeah, that says 200. I accidentally miss a zero. I set. And then I burn it up in the atmosphere. Well, smash enough. I didn't put it high enough. And then it'll put your orbital velocity in the atmosphere. And that's often a problem because, um, you know, orbital velocity in the atmosphere of Eve is pretty dangerous. Especially if you've got a plane. Eve looks really nice now. I'm over the ocean, apparently. So yeah, that's a problem you can have with it, which means you can go really fast in the atmosphere, um, which is pretty crazy. So, and obviously, oh, I don't have deadly wrench on, but if I said, say, I don't know, where's, where do you burn up an Eve? Um, 50k? Maybe? Cool. Yeah, now I'm burning up like crazy. Look at that, going nuts. And if I had deadly wrench on, that'd be a really big problem. Um, yeah. Just watching it going up. Wow, that is insane. Let's just watch that for a while. Retrograde. Can't, my camera's all screwed up. Oh, there you go. Uh, wonder how long that'll burn for. Look, look at them. Just, they're fine. But obviously, uh, moving planets is, you know, pretty difficult. Which means making rescaled Kerbin wouldn't be as hard as, you know, um, I first thought. Because there's a planet editor as well. Um, so if I say selected E, for example, you can change its gravity, its temperature, its... I don't think you can actually change its size, but um, that's the kind of thing. And you can change its pressure, which is which is really cool. And you can, whoa, you can change its atmosphere color. I literally haven't used um, hybrid it until today, then I accidentally put the moon in Kerbin. And then, uh, then, then I made a video. <laughs> And I could obviously slow down. Anyway, this is no fun. What I want to be doing is uh, rearranging the solar system. <laughs> this is obviously a test save because I've got a lot going on in this save. 
including a certain cinematic series I have mentioned. Right, let's go to Jewel. So I'm going to want that to be about 500k. I want it to be... Uh, let's hide out at Lathe, I guess. Go. That's probably within its sphere of influence. Oh no, I keep accidentally typing in the box rather than going to map view. There we go. Nicely around Lathe, where nothing can hurt us. Right. What do I want to be in orbit of Jewel, I wonder? Hmm. You know what? I miss home. Let's move Kerbin out here. Um. Not the sun. That's that's no fun. I want it to be around Jewel. <laughs> I could put it around... Give me a minute, and I've just had the best idea ever. Yep, best idea ever. No one has ever had a better idea ever. This will need to be pretty high up, so let's put it at, like, one million. Oh, hey, Kerbin, how you doing? And the moon and Minimus have joined me. Oh, that's Kerbin. That's Val. Why has Val changed orbit? Oh, it hasn't. It just looks like it has, because Minimus is there. The moon is going nuts. That really screwed some stuff up. Um, let's follow the moon into Jewel, shall we? Okay, no, I've got to really quickly go to the moon. I want to see it not in the map view. Right, um, select my active vessel. Body moon. Orbit 100k. Let's go. Okay, now we're here. Uh... Oh, damn it, man. Same thing? No. Okay, right. The, you're... Oh, hey, hey, things that shouldn't be here. Wait a minute, one second. Is that within the atmosphere? <laughs> like, quite possibly? That's insane. Okay. This is an awesome view. I think I found my thumbnail. Oh. Oh, shit, son, that's what I wanted to see. This is so complicated to kind of try to keep track of. Where are we? I think we're about to re-enter with the moon. Um, all right, let's see what happens, I guess. I have no idea what's going to go go down here. Map view. Jewel is moving away from... We're still orbiting Kerbin. But in a really weird orbit. Look. I think that's what's going on. Oh! So we're still orbiting Kerbin. So, oh, here we go. I think we're coming in Jewel now. Because it just managed to move away. Then. I wonder what will happen. Oh, we're inside Jewel. <laughs> that went well. Wow, look how small the moon is compared to Jewel. But it isn't rendering the physics for Jewel. That's interesting. Complicated. Very complicated. Right. Okay. What else can we do? Oh, I want to put a big or... Hmm. Hmm. I think Jewel needs to orbit... Okay, Jewel's coming to Duna. <laughs> this is gonna... I'm gonna really screw up the system. Okay. Set body. Duna. Select orbit. Jewel. Reselect body to Juna. Um, altitude. Oh, how big is Jewel? It'll have to be something with bigger... Okay, it's going to have to be Eve, isn't it? It has more influence. Um, Eve. Oh, no. Select body to... Jewel. Select body, Eve. Um, oh, God, how big is Jewel? Okay, we're going to have to put it out at... 6 million, will that be high enough? I don't know how big Jewel is. I have... Oh, 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 where am I at? So, I'm still, I don't know where I am. Okay, uh, let's put me around somewhere where I can get a cool thumbnail, I guess. Wait, where are we? We see anything? There's a lot of stuff going on. I should be able to see something. All right, let's put me in orbit of... Lays would probably have a pretty good view. Kerbin, maybe. Okay, right. Um, <laughs> this is just me trying to find a thumbnail. Oh, no, no, no. Edit active vessel. <laughs> Put me around Kerbin at, say, 100k. 
Let's go. Are we there? Oh, no, fucking hell. Uh. I think we're here. So there's Eve. There's Kerbin. Rotating weirdly fast. Am I time warping? Yes, I am. I want to get closer to Eve. So let's just orbit around, I guess. Bloody hell. Fine. Put me at 500k. Then I get to orbit better. Or uh, time warp faster, even. Orbit better? Yeah, I get to orbit better. Okay, don't render physics and don't put me on side jewel. There's Kerbin. I've got to somehow get this all in a screenshot. This is so much bullshit. I, ah, oh, I might rearrange the system one day and just, oh, well, ooh, Kerbin and Eve are about to collide. Oh look, there's Eve just dipping into <laughs> Jules' atmosphere. Okay, I've got to somehow get a screenshot of this. Maybe from Kerbin? No. Ah, oh, it's focusing on Kerbin. Okay, maybe from Eve. No, it's for, it only focuses on map view. Alright. I mean, this is pretty cool, but it's not cool enough. Hmm, how do I get them both in the picture? Plant. We have time, I reckon. Edit. Curb. Kerbin's technically orbiting Eve right now, but very complicatedly. Uh, around Jewel, but triple that, I reckon. There you go. Still not fantastic. Pretty fantastic, but not quite. Ah, uh, we'll just come around again. Okay. <laughs> oh, really? Do try this out for yourself. Um, on a set, on a game, game and save. You don't care about. Oh, okay, we're gonna have to warp in today. My life is so difficult. You know. Are we in the day yet? Oh no. Oh, perfect. I think. Yep. Hide all this. Hide all this. Like such. And I think we have our screenshot for the episode. There you go. Okay, now. This is a bigger... Okay, right. Let's talk some kind of game science. God, this has gone on a while. Um, what is happening here is a huge body is orbiting a much smaller body because it isn't because the orbits in KSP aren't based on physics. They are, in fact, based on... Um, I'm going to try doing some orbital leaping real quick. Um, the, uh, the orbits in the KSP are, in fact, based on preset rails rather than... Um, oh, jeez. What was I talking about? Uh, rather than actual... Um, Oh, rather than the physics of the planets, because obviously you move in, your ships move into um, orbits of stuff through, uh, like, a physics engine. Okay, my RCS button's broken because I've been fucking with things so much. Uh, um, but obviously, in we're, with planets, that would be a lot more calculations, and it would be pointless, and then you'd get planets pulling each other slightly and changing the orbits, and that'd be a lot for the game to process. But anyway, I want to see what happens when I escape. Um... I'm burning with everything because I have no benefit from the, well, pretty much no, look, there's a lathe. <laughs> I have pretty much no benefit from the air, um, Oberth effect because I'm in a very high orbit. Because my, the parent body is Jewel, and the parent body of Jewel is Eve. So, I want to know what'll happen. And the funny thing is, all these moons, they look like they're orbiting Eve, orbiting Jewel, which are orbiting Eve. They are Eve's moon's moons right now, which is pretty crazy. Come on, let's, let's, uh, I might bring some more planets in in a second, but I might just end this episode, because I, can't. I was going to say I have things to do, but I really don't, I have literally, like, no work to do right now. I, could, I have work I could be doing, but no work I need to be doing, and I can get it done some other time, so I can't really be bothered. Um, work ethic is no fun. Come mm. on, let's escape. This is ridiculous. Why don't I make a better vessel? 
This is currently any e jewel, but it, there'll be no uh, ah, and Eve. I was right, um, but there'll be no change and stuff because uh, this is they're not rendered for physics. We've got a little way to go. I think it's starting to escape faster, but Jesus Christ. Uh, let's go. Come on. I want to escape. I want to see what will happen. Maybe I'll just warp through this in real life. Why, am I, why aren't I physically time warping? I'm dumb. Oh, what did I just get? What am I, what am I encountering? I've got a moon encounter inside Jewel. So, let's keep going. There's my moon encounter. Uh... What comes next, I wonder? Uh, there's Moon Encounter, Moon Parry Apps. There will be some serious videos soon. Ah, uh, Curb and Escape. What do we get after the... I think that flings me off into the solar system, but there's no orbit indicators because it doesn't know what's going on. I think I broke the physics engine. I might just get clear of Jewel and then see what happens. Actually, I'll be clear of Jewel because of orbit changes. What will go now? I think that's apparently a moon encounter. Not a... Oh, no! Okay, I'll be in orbit of something else, so it won't render me into Jewel. Okay, now we're escaped. I think that's... That's Curb and Escape. That's my Jewel periaps. I think I'm going to be flung off into infinity. Because there's Eve escape. <laughs> it doesn't know what's going on! This is so complicated! That's such a weird orbit. Okay, I'll, I'll slow that down a bit. But I'm still technically orbiting Kerbin. Or at least moving with Kerbin, being pulled around by it. While orbiting Jewel. While orbiting Eve. And while orbiting the Sun. Oh, now I've escaped. Now where am I? The Sun. It did have some rent. Whoa, that's a leap. Alright, you know what? That screwed up everything. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to hyper-edit Eve into the sun. Oh, look at this! It's broken the entire game! This is a separate game save, don't worry. Um, although it does have my upcoming cinematic series on it, so... Uh, may have lost that. I can probably pull the craft files out or hack it or something. Um, altitude. Uh, what should we put it? Just like... Um, 50k body. Oh no. Uh, oh yeah. Select body. Sun. Where well, was the sun? The fuck. Okay. So select orbit to edit. No, oh, I was looking the wrong thing. <laughs> so I want to put Eve on a 50k orbit with the sun. Uh, go! Broke something and put active vessel on a 50k orbit with the moon. <laughs> go! I am now in the sun. Oh no, I'm just next to the sun. Oh no, fuck, fuck that up. <laughs> I'm gonna have fun editing this. That's the sun. And this is. Let's watch this orbit. Those are things just dipping into the sun. <laughs> Can't walk faster, that sucks. That's ridiculous. Anyway, um, while you watch this mess of planets that I have screwed up, and I might even do some kind of weird series with this, if I can think of anything to do. Um, I hope you've enjoyed this. I, I hope you tried this out for yourself. And hopefully don't screw up your entire game, slash PC, slash UI. Um, I hope you've enjoyed the thumbnail. That took ages to get. Is that lathe or Kerbin? Lathe. I, 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 I have, I, I, don't, I don't really have an outro because I'm so just surprised about stuff. Anyway, um, I do hope you've enjoyed this. If you've liked this video, um... Feel free to like this video. I'll link HyperEdit in the description because it's not hard to find, but there's a little hard to find. Harder than, say, Deadly Reentry. Um, what even? Why is Lave there? Oh, I'm so confused. Anyway, this has been Chaos People Tape. I'll see you next time.